Academy Awards recently opened entries to um, the best films released globally, and the Nigerian Oscar Selection Committee, NOSC, has announced a call for feature film entries by Nollywood filmmakers into the 93rd Academy Awards. Mm. The committee's chairperson, Chineze Anyene, said, and I quote, we were able to make our first ever entry submission to the Oscar for the International Feature Film Awards category as a country. Of course, that was last year. And um, the awareness this has brought to the industry as a whole has been amazing. It has opened the industry to other markets, and we hope to see partnerships with other industries soon. End of quote. The event is slated to hold on the 25th of April, 2021. Mm. Yeah, I like this. I like this. I like the inclusion of Africans and the African industry into the international space. That is, it's not just. I'm not even speaking for just Nigeria right now. I'm speaking about Africa as a continent as a whole. That people are beginning to see the amount of work and talents that we have in this part of the world, and they're beginning to appreciate us. So, you know, in almost every award, there is. Um, a category for us to be featured one way or the other and I think that is progress regardless of some people may not be content but I can remember when we had Joey Akin on this table and then we're talking about the Grammys and then people saying that they want Afro Beat Awards specially blah 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 and it was like this is an American they don't owe you anything the fact that they're putting you there is because they see an effort in what you're doing so I think this is just one of those times when we just have to be grateful that Yes, we begin to get it. And then I don't know what's holding people back from sending out their entries already because um, I don't even think they needed to make this call, like start sending entries. Of course, they need to make the call. If not, you won't be able to send any entry anywhere. Who's going to receive it? Mm. But for me, I mean, I, I just feel like people are not following, to, actually. Of course, people are following those who are interested. But mm. this takes me back to. Um, when the Genevieve and Nadi conversation started mm. regarding her movies that was put in for, um, mm. um, um, what's it called, the Oscars now, mm. and um, she didn't get it. And a lot of conversations started regarding King of Boys, regarding other movies that people thought could have clinched the award. Mm. I mean, it could have, not even the award, the, the nomination. You know, hers was a disqual disqualification case or something. So um, the conversation then was regarding how publicized the, and uh, when it was time um, to get the entries, how publicized was that? How many people heard about it? Um, the mainstream media didn't mm. know anything about it. You know, that conversation came up um, quite a lot. And I'm glad that the NOSC um, heard that. And I think they are partnering with media platforms right now to push out the message. And anybody that doesn't hear about this right now just didn't pay attention. Oh, no, it's not or just you probably interested. don't have anything to put out there, you mm. know, that is um, Oscar standard. So this is an opportunity for everyone to um, send in what they think um, meets the standard because of course that conversation helped us understand the criteria as well regarding um, indigenous language and what they expect the percentage um, the translation and all that so we have even if you're not in that space we have a fair idea mm. of what it is and this I'm going to use this opportunity to probably call on those who will be wanting to send in their entry. I mean, you know the criteria. If you don't meet that criteria, kindly do not bother sending it so that these people can have enough time and space to go through other movies that ha have got that um, 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 whatever it is they're looking for and be able to make the right decision for us right now because this is about us as Nigerians, not just about the filmmakers or just about Nollywood or the people on NOSC. So let's just do the right thing at the right time. And I'm hoping um, that we can trust their judgments um, to pick the right movie this time around to mm -hmm. at least clinch that nomination for I mean that that would be it yeah? yeah I mean we hope for that so good luck to everyone looking out to that and it's also worthy to mention that this is the first and only one that they are going to consider movies that didn't get to the cinema because of COVID-19 mm -hmm. um, but you yeah. have to have been stated to be yeah, in you the have, cinemas you, you, you should like, have had the plan I, li I like yeah. that as well because um, it's it you can't lose on both hands mm -hmm. like there are a lot of people that put out a lot of money for their movies to get to the cinema but because of the COVID-19 the pandemic, pandemic yeah. they, the, the movies never saw the light the of cinema, day of yeah. the cinemas and um, I just but they must have streamed on a reputable commercial platform. streaming platform. So I just think yeah. that is good because you, you can't put in all the work and then because of a pandemic we know how difficult those times are but at least you know when you still consider people knowing that it is a pandemic mm. it's nobody's fault but your work is still being appreciated. Yeah, so kudos, and we'll be watching the space closely to know um, what Nigerian movie will be sent in.